Hello and welcome to Shiny Crochet. I am so excited to announce an upcoming video series for my first crochet along. In 2020, I made a giant hobs for a charity giveaway to raise money for child's play. I filmed the whole process and at long last, I have made it into a tutorial. Please enjoy the photos of the fun I had with this good boy before he was shipped off to America from Australia to be auctioned in a Canadian charity stream. <laughs> For details on that, see description below for links to Desert Bus for Hope and Child's Play. This Hobbs is large. Due to the scale of this project, I have broken it into segments. A new part will be released every two weeks until complete, making it a fantastic make-along to join in. The written pattern is available on Ravelry now. Check the link in the description below. What you'll need to make this. 10 ply or Aran weight yarn of your choice in three colours, orange, black and cream. The yarn I used was unlabeled, but I believe it was Red Heart Saver. Because it was unlabeled, I'm unsure of how much of each color, but a full ball of each is recommended. For other equipment, you will need a 4.5 millimeter hook, though you should do a test with the yarn you use and make sure there are no gaps. Go up or down a size as needed. You could also use eight ply yarn and a 3.5 millimeter hook. However, that will result in a much smaller toy. You will also need a yarn needle, scissors, stitch markers, and or pins, and a heck of a lot of polyfill stuffing. I use US terminology in my patterns. Each video will include a list of stitches in the description below with the translation to UK terminology as needed. The pattern will be shown on screen throughout the videos. This can be a handy reference so you don't need to rewind as often, but also if you're looking to learn to read patterns. As I work through the pattern, a small yellow dot will move down the list for the steps. It is written shorthand, more as a reminder than instructions on their own. I have also been releasing some beginner videos to support the pattern. So if you're not sure of a stitch or term, be sure to check that out. A playlist is linked above and in the description below. Keep in mind, I was still finishing off the written pattern while making the video. So there will be some times where the footage is a little different to the written pattern, or even what I say in the voiceover. I'll try my best to let you know when this happens, and often the rule of thumb is do as I say, not as I do. If you're finding this much later than the crochet along, jump right in and enjoy. I'll be creating a playlist of this series and we'll put it up in the card above and a link in the description below. If you have any questions, drop a comment below. If you're joining in the make along, I'd love to see it. Use hashtag shiny giant cat on social media so we can find each other. I am so excited for this. It has taken a lot of time and work to bring this out. I think that's everything. So see you next Sunday for the next part being released. Hit the subscribe button to stay in the loop. Have a lovely day.